So these videos will be a new course and a new series on representation theory. I'm going to start with a quick reviewing on I'm going to need a concept here of the concept of group action. So I'm going to do a quick revision of this concept. So uh, what is a group? A group is a given set that we are going to call it G and one operation, right? And you can go back to my list of group theory videos to check all the conditions for this set and this operation to be a group. So um, now <clears throat> not only we have this uh, group G, but we also have a set. So X I'm going to call X a given set. Okay, so we have a group and we have a set. And now that I have a group and a set, um, let us pick a map. Uh, unfortunately, I'm going to change the operation here. I'm, like, I'm going to call it plus. Okay, so now I have a, a map. Uh, G times X that goes to X. So for this operation we will write it like this GX or we can also write G star X or simply GX. Okay? So G will be an element from the group G and X will be an element from the set X. Okay, we dive directly into the definition. Let X be a set and G a group. An action of G on X is a map. Let's call it star from the group G times, this is the binary operation, X into X, such that one identity times X equals X, where X is an element in the set, don't forget that X is a set, and two, uh, there, there is some kind of uh, associativity here, G1, G2 associated times X equals G1 times G2 X. So this X will be in the set and G1 and G2 will be in the group. Okay, so if these two things happen under these conditions, X is a G set. So this is what we call an action of a group on a set. So, or we say G, the group, the group G acts, acts on the set X. So we have a group action. Okay, quick example. Uh, we pick X, any set. So X is a set. And we pick H, a subgroup. H is a subgroup of the symmetric group, um, where uh, so this X, this this is a symmetric group of all permutations of the elements of X. Okay, if X has, for instance, five elements, so we will be in. Uh, the symmetric group 5, S5. Okay, so H is a subgroup of the symmetric group of X. Okay, oh, so the symmetric group, all permutations of X. 
So in this case, we say that x is an h set. Okay. So what is the the action? Sigma will be in H, right? Because this is a subgroup of the symmetric group. Okay. So sigma will be a permutation. And this so this sigma will be the action. Okay? Because X is an H set. So sigma will be a permutation from the subgroup H. Okay. On on the the set X. Okay, so this will be an action, okay, as an element of uh, the symmetric group. Okay, uh, the action will be, so we have an element X, X, X in the set, and the action will be sigma, the permutation, okay, and that will be sigma x, okay, for all x in the set, okay. So, so this is very easy to check that those two conditions are um, um, I mean these two conditions are satisfied, okay, that the identity times an element in the set equals the element and this second condition. Okay, just use the, the permutation composi compositions. Very easy to, to check that. So in order to check, just just try with any set with n elements, okay, and check that with a symmetric group of n.